All right, I want to talk about something super important that applies to not only women, but like literally everyone, and it is the number of fake butts that you see in checkout counter, on reality TV, on Instagram, when you see some girl who's just huge and like this big of legs and this big of waist and a giant butt, that's tens of thousands of dollars of plastic surgery. That's not squats, that's not deadlifts, that's not donkey kicks. There's nothing you can do in the gym. There's no nutrition to get that. That's plastic surgery. That's one, implants. Two, literally cutting fat from another part of her body and putting it in her butt. That's what's going on. But when you Google how to get insert reality TV stars butt, you get do this exercise, do this many reps, do this 15 minute workout, and it's both. And it's not just like, it's not just high school girls. It's women in their 20s, it's women in their 30s, it's women in their 40s who email me. I heard 70 year old women last week talking about like the fat underneath their arms and comparing themselves to celebrities and how do I get this gone? How do I do this? The, the like comparison in general is the worst thing because it gets you in your head, it gets you in a negative state. But like for these celebrities to be lying about plastic surgery and then like for articles to be published saying that you can get this if you just do X, it's a lie. I'm sick of it. That's it. Of course you can build glute muscles, you can build a butt, you can build strength, but to have no muscle in your legs and then a huge butt, and then a tiny waist from a celebrity, plastic surgery.